Hello and welcome to another Andrew Marshall Fitness meal prep video. Today I am making a Cajun, sorry, a sweet and sour pork. It's only like three ingredients, very easy to put together. I'm cooking up six portions, it's going to take about 20 minutes, start to finish. Also, for those who want their hands in a free custom meal plan and fat loss webinar, stick around to the end and I'll show you exactly how to get it. This is everything you need for this. Now you can swap the pork out for chicken if you want, it doesn't really make a difference. So we've got garlic granules, diced pork. Now this is key here, so it's sweet and sour, no sugar added. Make sure I'm getting no sugar added one, that makes a massive difference. Some basmati rice, again, the veg is optional, you don't even need it. There's veg in this, there's enough, there's some of it through it. Total up to yourself, but I'm going to add in some pepper and red onion, then salt and black pepper, that's it. So, as I said, I'm going to be making six portions, so all I'm going to do is weigh out the rice, 60 grams each serving. Make this to suit your goals, again, it doesn't matter, it'll be completely different. If, and if you're watching this in a meal plan, the quantity will be in your spreadsheet. So I'm weighing out 360 total, and when you're dividing up at the end, if you've weighed it out properly for the portions, all you need to do is weigh the total, divide it by the amount of meals you're having, and that's you, you can just portion out the rice that way. So 360 grams, and all I'm going to do is add salt to it. The best thing to do is just put the rice on in the background, just boiling water, it takes like 10 to 12 minutes, and then forget about it, set a timer, and start kind of cutting up everything else. So I'm just going to chop up this onion pepper, and then we cut up all the diced pork, just cut it down a bit finer, and weigh it out into a bowl, so I know how much I've got for each serving. So the veg is cut up and off to the side. Now one thing to keep in note is just make sure and stir that rice every few minutes. Again, it should only take 10 to 12 minutes, but it does all stick together if you don't keep it moving. Just, just to give it a stir with a spoon in a couple of minutes. Next, I'm just cutting and weighing out this pork, so I know exactly how much I've got um, over across the two packets. Um, and then if there's spare, I'll just tub it up and freeze it. I'm wanting around 125 grams for each serving, six servings, that is like 750, quick maths there. Um, so if you get spare, keep a hold of it, you can use these things in the future or just use it at the time. If you're going to cook up a quick meal or cook an extra meal, just whatever suits you. So next pan at high heat, pork is all weighed out and I diced up a wee bit more. I'm probably do this in two goes here, um, if I can. We'll see how the first lot looks. Um, nah, fuck it, I'm going for it. Just put that in, and then season with salt, pepper, and garlic powder, and then the sausage uh, bread will be in a minute. So the pork's had a couple of minutes, now I'm just going to stick in the veg and stir it through. Give that another two to three minutes, um, just to soften everything up. Again, everything a right good season with that. Don't be shy on them, <laughs> um, just going to add to it. Give it a stir about, give it another two to three minutes, then the sausage will be going in. So that's had a couple of minutes. Um, the pork is probably almost cooked most of the way through. So all I'm going to do is add in two of these. Now I'm making six, so obviously that's quite a lot of portions. You do not need that much sauce if you're only using, maybe maybe making up two or three. Um, but again, just make it to suit yourself. So all I'm going to do is add this in. <laughs> it's quite a lot of fucking food. But again, it's going to be like a week's worth. And what I'm going to do at the end, is you can hopefully see in the background, there is six tubs over there. I'm just going to portion these out, keep three out and put three in the freezer. That means when I go to take them out the following the week, they're going to be fresh, they're going to be fine, they're going to be ready to go. Now, one wee quick thing to touch on here, I'm going to lift these off here for this, the sauce. So, there is, let me see here, um, per jar, 440 grams per jar. So, in total, that is 880 grams for the full entire six servings. So 880 divided by six is like 120. Now all I do when I'm putting it into my fitness pal or trying to keep track of things, is scan the label, put 120 grams in, change the serving size in my fitness pal, it's easily done, it's so easy to do, and that's how you get you gauge how much sauce you're getting for each serving. It's not gonna be exact, but as long as you're tracking the total, 
it's going to be perfectly fine. It's the same for when I weighed out the pork. 750 grams divided by six is 125. So that's how much I'm putting in each day. Exact same for the rice. 60 grams each day, six times, easily done. That's how you crunch the numbers. So the pork's had about 10 minutes to just simmer. Now this is where, you, as you can see, the rice is portioned out, six equal servings into six tubs. Now this is, can be a bit difficult, of course, but I just eyeball it. So we'll do like a couple of scoops in each at a time to start. I could probably have got a bigger spoon for this. That would have been a good idea. Um, but you get the idea and you just continue to go along, adding similar quantities into each one until it's until it's finished. Again, it doesn't need to be exact. Don't worry too much about it being off or having maybe one portion size slightly bigger than the other. It's not gonna cheat not gonna um you know make a massive difference at the end of the day. And just go along until everything's portioned out. Just putting a wee bit in each time. That's worked out not too bad there. Um, that's probably going to be six-ish equal servings. Um, if there's any one that you think maybe two not not got enough in it, or maybe one not got enough in it, and one's maybe get too much, then just go ahead and change them up. But that's a quick and easy sweet and sour pork recipe. Again, you can swap out the pork for chicken. I just think it's good for a change sometimes. That's all. Um, you could probably even use lamb or something. I don't know. <laughs> Some other meat doesn't matter. Turkey, something like that. Hopefully this was helpful. If it was, please let me know. Leave a like, comment below how you enjoyed it. Also, for those who wanted the fat loss and custom fat loss webinar and custom meal plan, all you have to do is comment fat loss below and I'll get that over. See you in the next one. Hello and welcome back to another Andrew Mars from Fitness and Meal Prep video. Today we're cooking up some Chinese chicken wraps. Three ingredients, easy, simple, quick and effective. Also, for those who are looking for a free custom meal plan and fat loss webinar, comment below, fat loss, and I'll send it over.